A freak accident under investigation after a school bus runs over its driver, killing him. Investigators believe the school bus somehow slipped out of park and then ran the district employee over. Thank you for joining us. Ten everybody, I'm Bob Clawson. And I'm Ashley Katz. This all happened in Little Rock near Town Oaks and Treasure Hill. KRK 4s Mitch McCoy broke this story today. He's been on it ever since. Tonight he's live at police headquarters where investigators are tonight. Mitch. Yeah, Bob and Ashley, good evening. It's important to tell you right off the top that there are no students involved in this accident or students that witnessed this accident. Tonight, Little Rock police officers here at headquarters that have specialized training in accident reconstruction going step by step, trying to figure out exactly how that school bus slipped gears. Crime scene tape surrounds a school bus that police say killed its driver. It's shocking. The crash happened off Town Oaks near Treasure Hill in West Little Rock. Deanna Shaw lives nearby. One day you hear, next minute you're gone. Little Rock police believe the bus was in park, but somehow flipped gears. Investigators say the bus was parked up here. That's when the driver got out and the bus started rolling. The driver got caught underneath. The bus then hit this tree. Incredibly rare. Pulaski County Special School District spokeswoman Jessica Duff says the driver had just finished working on another school bus that had mechanical problems. You don't hear about these kinds of accidents, especially in the manner in which everything occurred. It's kind of sad and heartbreaking, even though you don't know the person because it's, it's crazy. Little Rock police say the freak crash happened Monday afternoon around 2. No students were on board or witnessed the accident. Our reconstruction units will be uh, interviewing witnesses. Uh, anybody that saw anything. He probably didn't even have no intentions of the bus shifting out of gear. While investigators figure out how the bus flipped into drive, others are left without words. It just leaves you speeches. Top school officials telling me within the last hour that they have notified the victim's family, but they're not releasing the school district's employee until tomorrow morning. So that way the family has time to cope and they can let other family members know about their loved one's death. If you saw what happened or you have any information that may help officers out, you're asked to call the Little Rock Police Department. We're live at police headquarters downtown. Mitch McCoy, KRK4 News.